Decodable Lesson 3. By this stage, hopefully you've mastered the challenges in the Smeeborg section. So we're going to have a look at Function Junction. Um, and this is using something called functions to, um, to enable you to basically write less code. So in that way, it's, it's, it's got similarities with, with loops. So I've already started this level. Let me go into one um, that's a good example to show you. So I've got a relatively straightforward path through here, uh, but I haven't got enough squares uh, to just do the basic sequence. So what I need to do is to create um, a function uh, that I can repeat. So to start off with, I could go right, up, and right. So I'm going to make that as my first function. So right, up, and right. So that will take me to there. Okay, next thing I need to do is just go down. So I'll just add that to my code. Now my next three instructions um, are like my first three. It's going to be right, up, and write. So instead of having to code that in three, um, three separate um, instructions, I'll just say I will use that function that I've already used to just do the same thing um, again. And then I just need to add in a couple more commands to get myself to the end. So I'll just play that through, and if you just watch my my functions just working their way through, so fairly similar to loops. It's just a way of um, uh, of basically using less code um, to do the same job.